Hi, my name is Rose. I am nine years old. I am in the Fairview 4-H Club. I go to Deer Park Homelink. This is my first time doing a 4-H presentation. I've had a rabbit for three years. What I'm talking about today is Bunny Care 101. You might be thinking, we want to get a rabbit. First question you should ask yourself is, what breed? According to American Rabbit Breed Association, there are 49 different breeds. One of the biggest breeds is the Flemish Giant. One of the smaller breeds is the Flemish Giant, who weighs up to 20 pounds. One of the smaller breeds is, well, Pearl. Pearl is a dwarf hotot, who weighs up to 3 pounds. Dwarf hotots are called the mascara breed, because as you can see, there's a black dot around her eye. I'm going to set Pearl down now and grab Jane. I'll be right back. Jane is what you call a mixed breed. She's half lion head and half lop. As you can see, she's a little bit bigger than Pearl. That's because lion heads are miniatures and laps are mediums. So she'll be a little bit bigger. For those of you that are smaller, I would suggest a miniature breed because if you got the Flemish Giant, it'd be very awkward to hold. Now on to food, shelter, water. We'll start with food. Food for a rabbit is very simple. All you need is a pelleted rabbit food, a salt lick, and a salt lick that comes from the feed store. And treats. The treats I give my rabbits are carrots, clovers, and grass hay. They can eat it and they can burrow in it. Now on to shelter. Shelter, most people in the cities have their rabbits running around in their apartments, but since I don't live in the cities, my bunnies are in a barn and a hutch, so cold or water can't get to them during the winter. But during the summer, I have them in an outside pen with chicken wire on the bottom of it and slats thin enough so they can't run away and a cover top so prayers can't swoop in and kill them. You want to clean your hutch once a week. Now on to water. Water for a bunny is very, very simple. All you need is fresh, cold water available to your rabbits at all times. If you see green or brown spots in your water bottle, it means you need to clean it. There's mold in your water bottle. Now on to bunny care basics. You want to know if you're holding your rabbits correctly. I'm holding Jane correctly because they're her legs are on my arms so they're supported and I'm holding her tightly so she's secure. You want to brush your long hair rabbits once a week. If your bunny is sick, you want to know, know right away. Here are some symptoms. Goopy eyes and ears, stiffness, losing a lot of hair, not eating enough food, and loose poop. If you see any of these symptoms, call your veterinarian right away. Having a bunny is a big responsibility. If you get one, I hope you love them as much as I do. Do you have any questions?